A ver, ¿ya pueden hablar? ¿Pero qué les aparece, muchachos? ¿Qué les aparece? ¿Qué mensaje les aparece o qué pasa? Ah, ok. Let me check. A ver. Mm. A ver, déjenme checar, porque realmente no le moví nada sobre. I don't know what's happening. Creo que ya. A ver, a usted le solicité hablar. ¿Los demás pueden hablar o no? Ok, miren. Um, no sí. sé qué está pasando. Ok, you can talk. A ver, los demás, déjenme ponerles aquí solicitar para reactivar audio. Solicitar para reactivar audio. ¿Quién más? A ver, solicitar para reactivar audio. A ver, intenten hablar, muchachos. Creo que ya. Creo okay. que ya se puede. ¿Ya? ¿Los demás? Carolina, Alan, ¿ya pueden hablar? Yo no puedo, dice Carlos. A ver, déjeme, le solicito. Solicitar para reactivar audio. Ya. Yeah. Ok. ¿Los demás todavía pueden o ya no pueden? Ok, dice Juliana. Eh, um, hagan de cuenta que al que le solicite hablar, va a hablar. Pero si apagan el micro, ya no van a poder hablar. Entonces, bueno, no sé por qué pasó esto, pero vamos a hacer esto, muchachos. Como van a hacer el speech el día de hoy, aquí en el chat me van a decir quién quiere comenzar a hacer el speech. Me van a avisar, yo, yo quiero hacer el speech y les voy a solicitar el audio y el video a cada persona. ¿Ok? Montserrat quiere comenzar entonces. Voy a solicitarle a Montserrat. El audio y el video. Listo. Ya. Okay. Uh, good les voy a hablar sobre San Carlos y Comparative Nayarit, sobre una comparación de Nayarit. Es San Carlos. I show San Carlos because it, it is good if they um, to go see It's a very nice place. It uh, has very nice beaches. Uh, almost uh, the beaches are together. It is a distance and some hard behi. And um, others one block uh, from the right. Uh, it also has very nice places to hit uh, with the family for explain. Mercado San Carlos is right next, next to the Tortuga restaurant. Uh, the sell coast, the sell same food, and also breakfast. The There are also hotels with very nice pools. The pools uh, are a bit expensive, but is the it's good to Spain that uh, with the family. Uh, in Nayarit, uh, la comparación de Nayarit uh, in 
and measure it uh, very different because there is only one beach. Uh, there is more than rivers and also for meals, there are snacks. Uh, that <laughs> is what restaurants are called. The seal only sells food and you pay for um, the food. It is a very good place that I recommend it, that the good to the visit. It is the culture, it is the beautiful. Um, no sé cómo se dice río. The river. The river eh, es lo más común. <laughs> Rivers. Okay. Um, y sería todo. All right. So you are Pérez Carrión. Okay. Pérez, le voy a dar un 90, Pérez. Okay. 90, um, because you need to talk a little bit more. And le falta un poquito de comparativo. Un poquito, mm -hmm. como decir, more than, is cheaper, is ex more expensive, kind of. Pero lo hizo muy bien, okay? So you have 90. Thank you. Okay. Today is three. Día de examen. Okay. ¿Quién quiere seguir? Aquí en el chat me pueden decir para reactivarles el, el audio. No sé, what is happening with um, Zoom? Ok, Carlos. Entonces, Carlos, le voy a pedir que reactive. A ver, reactivar. Ok. Eh, yo lo hice de, de un ejido que iba mucho. Unos Ajá. años. Ahí de, de Álamos. Está muy bonito. Eh, It's now a city. It's a community belong to the municipality of Alamos in the south of the state of Sonora. Uh, it's nothing expensive. Uh, it, it's very relaxed. Uh, it's very well location ejido and where the stay is very pleasant. Uh, the spirit, the presence of the drug trafficker It, this community live expensive. Uh, the channel is coming now for his many countrymen resident in other cities of the state, such as Ciudad Obregón, Navojoa, Hermosillo. Uh, these are now to be most hot dogs. Uh, So is is the uh, hot dogs hot dogeros popular in, in other other cities and okay. is famous. So is they they are famous. They are very mentioned the people in, of the China. Uh, the China is surrounded by mountain that remain green for much of the year. Is full of vegetation uh, in the town. Have, in the town, they have wa water uh, takes and thanks to the water hole through which the water is a domestic uh, supply to the house. Uh, there is a main church in the community. This respond the of the to the name of the san isidro labrador it, it is the best now uh, the china is is the is a town uh, very very smaller uh, near the shore there is a square where there is is a kiosk in the station commemory Benito Juarez. In the town of Lirin, on the outskirts, there is a crease, the king on the top of the, of the hill, uh, where the, the view of the entire town of the Shinal can be appreciated very well. 
Uh, the scenery is so beautiful that you went not to live. Even, even though it's a small company that empalme uh, Guaymas, uh, Obregón, etc. Uh, the scenery is one of the places and we'll go back to the one day. We leave many good friends and the good impression of me. Uh, the 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 winter the winter uh, is parent and parent and hermosillo eso eh, so um, I, I don't know but uh, is a a channel is 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 a winter is very good winter and and in some in summer is 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 hot uh, and uh in the december and and winter uh, is is very is more uh, cold uh, cool uh, winter cool. Uh, you started, okay. okay, so that town, that pueblito is near Alamos, right? Uh, around Alamos. Around Alamos. And what's uh, uh, its name? ¿Cómo se llama? El Chinal. Okay, it's just a ranchito or it's just like a little, little pueblito? B, 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 yeah. Okay, yeah. Like a B, yeah, let's see. It, it, it's beautiful. Good, I imagine that, okay. So, great job, Carlos. Tiene 100, okay? Thank you. Good, good job. Good trying. Okay. Ponce Cuellar, ahí está, 100. Let me check first. Me está mandando mensajes, pero no tú. Ok, so, primer anuncio, muchachos. Eh, claro eh, que van a esperar a que cada uno de los estudiantes diga su speech. Y ya hasta que el último ya termine y todo, ya nos vamos a poder retirar. Pero hay que esperarnos a que este, cada uno diga su parte para tener participación y que también puedan escuchar ustedes eh, practicar el listening. Okay. So, who's next? ¿Quién quiere seguir? Aquí en el chat, díganme para activarles el audio. Porque andas un muy enfadoso con eso del, del audio. Who wants to be next? No se peleen, no más uno. Si escuchan así como que mucho ruido afuera, yo creo que andan los de la basura o something. Ok, Alan, vamos a ver. Creo que Alan ya puede prender solo su audio, ¿no? A ver, cheque. No, you can't. Ok, let me okay. solicitar. A ver, chequele, ya le puse. Creo que ya. Ok. Este, sí se ve bien, se escucha bien. Es que en el mío como, eh, como que de repente se congela la imagen, pues. Yeah, I can hear you and I can see you. Good. Okay. Mm, I'm gonna I'm gonna talk about Javaros. Eh, Javaros is a little no small port, eh, eh, formerly called eh, Isla Las Viejas. Uh, this fishing town is full of surprises and different types uh, of bird species arrive in this place, such as um, such, uh, white pelicans, Canadian ducks, flamingos, and other types of birds. This makes uh, it a very loving and appreciated uh, place be, by bird watches. 
And the island of Javaros is well known for the production of canned sardines and the special sea salt of that place. Um, the, in the fishing activity is, is the, the, the one that enjoys the greatest tradition uh, in the area and is the most important economic activity for the port of Yavaros. Uh, fishing, uh, fishing, re, fishing resources such as shrimp, crab, clam, uh, cayo de hacha, Chinese snail, uh, tilapia, uh, shark, and manta represent the main species that are exploited in the area. Also, for for this reason, it, it is very suitable for sport fishing. Another of the things uh, that can be done here are the Mm, ¿Cómo es paseo? Porque a mí me salió como walk. For example, if you go and vas a turistear a pasar, you can say sightseeing. You go sightseeing. No, pero, o sea, eh, ok. Eh, oh, well, ¿cómo? if you say just go and pasear, caminar, es go for a walk. No, pa It's the same. pasear, pero, pero en, en bote, en panga. Oh, en bote. Oh, yeah. It's uh, kind of... Um, let me check. Let me check here. Porque... I don't know. Let me... It's a boat ride. A boat ride. Boat ride. Así como ride when you ride a bike. A boat ride. A boat ride. Como un paseo en bote. Um... And the uh, are the boat ride throughout the mangrove forest. This has been important for the bubble, uh, for the population and for the fauna. In this place, there are uh, there are three, three most important types of mangroves, such as the white mangrove, the black mangrove, and the one of the rarest is the red mangrove. Uh, in the boat road through these forests are quite uh, quite interesting and this also el kayaking if we make go shall be done with places on equal terms such as for such as Puerto Morgan in Spain which specializes in sport. Um, it is not specialized in fishing. We can find more endemic species in our Sonoran port than in the Spanish town. Another slightly different There's no but for sure, more active. This place has, and, and but if we can say something, it is that uh, you are surprised from the moment um, to you arrive, but for its restaurants with the homemade touch its views and the people and it's all okay so where is that place in mexico yes uh, is is a little town in uh, in los alrededores de guatabampo cerca de guatabampo okay. So, nada más le faltó compare one place with another. How about that? Compare it with why más? I don't know. Just tell me. Mande. Compare that place, Yavaros, I think is the name, with another place. Sí, compare. fue Puerto Morgan. Okay. Y Compositano. 
Okay, okay. So, well, nunca había escuchado that place, pero sounds interesting. Right. Um, yeah. Yo soy de allá, profe. Mm, Hernández Navarro, right? Sí. Tiene 100, Alan. Gracias. Okay, good job. También lo que pasa es que se me estaba trabando un poquito al final el internet con, con Alan, ¿eh? Y escuchaba como que una, unas partes y otras no, pero uh, it was a good, good speech. Don't worry. So, a ver, who wants to be next? ¿Quién quiere seguir, muchachos? Recuerden que terminamos todos y nos vamos, somos libres. Carolina, muy bien. Vamos a solicitar el audio. Okay. Yo creo que ya, Carolina. Yeah. Yes. Ok. Um, you already know me. My name is Carolina. I'm talking about almost in El Quelite. Uh, very close to the border with Sinaloa and Chihuahua is Almos, a magical town that surprised and sold of the fusion of Spain Baroque and or native peoples. Walking uh, through the its cobblestone streets in Ellis, you can admire admire or mention that are very preserved and tell stories uh, of other times especially the mini boom uh, due to the vein of la europea almost was a place i saw some years ago so i don't remember much about it According to my research, Alamos was founded on December 8, 1685. Originally, it was called Real de la Olimpia Concepción de los Alamos, and also Real de los Frailes, also known as La Ciudad de los Portales. Alamos was built, built by architects from the city of Andalusia, Spain. Among its main attraction is a pla Plaza de Armas in the heart of the city where its emblematic, emblematic Morse kiosk is located, surrounded by palm trees and beautiful curtains. Something you can do in places to visit in Alamos, Sonora was, uh, was our, uh, Plaza de Armas, El Callejón del Peso, uh, Palacio Municipal, Casa de Monedas, etc. Just as in Guanajuato, there is a uh, Kisinelli. In Alamos, Sonora, we, we also find a Kisinelli. Uh, among its cobblestone street, Uh, that tell a legend very similar uh, to the one in Guanajuato. As I recall, it's located on Jose Maria Guerra Flores Street, a few steps from the Plaza de Armas between two houses. Uh, compared to Alamos, uh, located uh, 38 kilometers uh, from Mazatlán is El Quelite. A picture a town with very colorful touches. It's a picturesque uh, place of a country style uh, with houses and pedes uh, built with Mexican ahogany mud bricks, um, wooden beams, uh, white cane and rope. El Calite is a perfect place to practice rural uh, tourism. This is due to its architecture, gastronomy, uh, landscape, flora and fauna observation, and national recognition uh, for the promotion of rural tourism. El Calite 
uh, offers a museum with murals uh, that tell us about uh, the story of the region. Also is the surrounding. Uh, you will find uh, tambora music, pre-Hispanic dance, charros, dancing horses, among other events. Uh, El Mesón de los Laureanos is uh, the best regional restaurant in Sinaloa. According to uh, what my parents were told, uh, this place offers ex exquisite uh, local gastronomy with aromas and seasoning of yesteryear. Uh, therefore, uh, the dishes we can find are carnitas prepared in of a style of the region and delicious barbacoa. It's located between uh, Benito Juarez Avenue and C de la Soca on Grand El, Priet El Prieto Suna Street. Pass the Talaverian El Quelite, turning right at the corner where the El Quelite sign is. Alamos and El Calite are very similar places with many emblematic places and four main pictures, pictures place with colorful touches. But if we see the difference, Alamos is the most known tourist place and it's bigger than El Calite. And you have, and you have to take into account that if you want a comfortable place and with more variety of restaurants, Alamos is better than El Calite since El Calite only has one no restaurant. All in all, I think I will stick with Alamos. Enough. Okay, great, great job and interesting information about both places, but really, really interesting. I didn't know Alamos was made by um, Spain people, right? From Spain, that's really, wow, I didn't know that. So good, good job, Carolina, tienes bien. Great job, as always, okay. Um, okay, yeah. También les voy poniendo la asistencia del día de hoy, muchachos, muy importante, por cierto. Um, ¿Quién quiere seguir? Tell me. Okay, Daniela. Muy bien, Daniela. La, let me check just. Vamos a ver si alguien tiene más faltas, ¿sí? porque no había checado eso. No, yo creo que todos tienen mínimo a los que tienen falta, es nada más una falta, entonces no hay problema. Bueno, Daniela, vamos a ponerle su audio. Creo que ahí está, Daniela. Uh, good morning. Eh, yo lo hice de Puerto Peñasco. Is a tourist and fishing city in Mexico on the Gulf of California. Look at between the Sea of Cortes and the Sonora Desert is it is a destination that has a unki natural wealth world where we will find high level tourist complex con exclusive golf course hill quality service grooming restaurant and endless opportunities to practice water activities but above all, you will get closer to a warm community of fin fishing origin with a great vacation of service. See, it is more admiring the surrounding building 
which resemble galleries of for their spectacular paintings of Wallis along with, with the cal colorful marine fauna near Bill it in monument er erected to honor man's association with the sad a large anchor and the ruler of a ship. On the other under San Carlos, I drink as many varieties since its varieties from Cerro Tetacawi, artificial crefts, uh, Los Algodones Beach, San Francisco Beach, Piedras Pintas Beach. Um, it is a also closer to visit visiting on on a spot a quiet time spending time with friends. Okay, good job, Daniela. Um, okay. Daniela, vamos a buscarla primero por aquí. Es ya Rodríguez. Rodríguez, good job. Tiene 90, ok. Good trying. I remember uh, Puerto Cuñasco. I used to, I used to go a lot to Puerto Cuñasco. It's really, really beautiful. Voy a, uh, aún me faltan muchachos. ¿Quién quiere seguir? Juliana, muy bien. I always said uh, Juliana and you are Juliana. But Juliana sounds really, um, really cute. So we ah, sí, es Juliana, pero me dicen Juliana, así que pues ya me acostumbré. Ok. So I'm good for that. Yo lo hice de San Carlos y de Atenas. Um, San Carlos is it considered the great tourist jewel of the state and it is not for less in a landscape considered considered at most spectacular sea view in the world. It's the beautiful beaches of white and the fine sand can blue sand and desert landscape. There are hotels for any budget, condoms, and fully equipped trailer parks. There is also a wide variety of restaurants that offer the typical grilled meat of the various fresh fish and set food dishes. When you sun goes down, the phone don't, don't stop as the bars and nights club open their doors to welcome past beer. And most see is the scenic viewpoint of Terra de Takawi, where the landscape of the city is the dominant. We live in Athens, the capital of Greece. It's a very old city that keeps endless cultural, historical, and architecture treasures. Where you go, you can feast your eyes on the incredible museums, discovering and ancient attempts that ill alive is very common you visit. The city is a place chosen by thousands of tourists a year who enjoy its culture, its museums, its spectacular views, its neighborhood, its gastronomy and traditions as it is a fascinating place full of history. Traveling to Atenas is a plan that you have to you at some point in your life. You cannot miss the opportunity to see of the Parthenon, the incredible museums, 
the length of Poseidon, the Dionysius theory of the Acropolis. Uh, the difference between Tito is that Athenas has many more tourist place, some of which are better I know of their history. Will is in San Carlos. There are more places with beaches, to wind build point, etc. Uh, but are very busy to know the year. No domination and antennas is bigger than San Carlos. In the first mentioned, there are more museums or plays with art. Will in second are there are some beaches of hills to explore. I feel time going place can be confined. In can you take time to go to know them and if more so if you are accompanied with friends or family. Yes, Okay, good job, Juliana. Juliana tiene 90. And okay. I know you can talk more. You need to talk more. Yo sé. Es que me confundo con las palabras. But don't worry about it. Es que you... sí me había aprendido una parte de lo que puse en el speech, speech el que entregué. Pero mm -hmm. aquí hice como un poquito de resumen porque eran como tres hojas de mi speech. Porque Atenas era mucha información. Okay, I know about that. But, guys... Cuando yo les encargo un ensayo, ¿sí? Que acuérdense que el ensayo vale solito, si ¿sí? el ensayo, 20 puntos. Y otros 20 puntos, el speech, ¿sí? Para no recargarles todo ese puntaje en un solo trabajo. Cuando hagan el speech, ustedes no necesitan aprenderse todo el ensayo para venirlo a decir aquí. Si ustedes pueden, adelante. Pero si no, créanme que intentando más o menos explicar con sus palabras que duren unos dos minutitos tratando de explicar la información, con eso van a tener sus 20 eh, puntos. No necesita ser perfect English ni hablar fluidísimo como un gringo, no. I know you can't, okay? But try, and I know, Juliana, you can. You can uh, try to talk. So next time, just talk, just talk, just try to, okay? Me gustaría que usted y aparte de usted, otros compañeros también, hay varios compañeros que ya pueden intentar empezar a soltarse. Por ejemplo, un ejemplo, no me gusta poner ejemplos precisos, pero nada más para que vean, por ejemplo, el compañero Carlos. Carlos ha tenido un gran avance en lo que yo, por ejemplo, los identifico cada uno que hemos tenido ya varios parciales, creo que varios cuatris juntos. Carlos empezó hablando poquito y poco a poco fue tratando y no importa que no sea perfecto todo, ¿verdad? Igual Alan, Alan también siempre ha hecho sus speech muy preparados, igual que Carolina, pero Alan también ha, este, ha subido un poquito más, su, eh, incluso su perfeccionalismo al momento de hablar, si en el tiempo en el que está hablando o usar pasado, usar futuro, etcétera. So, congratulations, guys, para los que han estado mejorando, los que han estado intentando. No importa que no sea perfecto. Montserrat también algunas veces intenta hablar un poquito. Eso también es bueno, aunque sea una que otra palabra intentar. Y yo sé que muchos les da un poquito de pena. Por ejemplo, Juliana, este, a lo mejor Daniela, e incluso Montserrat, etcétera. A lo mejor les da un poquito de pena, pero ya, muchachos, ya. Ya nos conocemos, ya nos conocemos, ya tenemos mucha confianza. Yo creo que ya es momento de que se les quite un poquito esa pena, ¿ok? Pero bueno, igual, yo no les bajo muchos, muchos puntos debido a eso. Ya saben que los ayudo muchísimo. So don't worry, good job, Juliana. You did a good job, you did a good speech, a good writing. Nada más que si intenten, muchachos, poco a poquito. Déjenme reiniciar Zoom porque nos falta todavía creo que unos compañeros, nada más déjenme reiniciar. 